Hello students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting video, I would like to tell you something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed on. If you find somewhere difficulty, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Now here is the question. The distance between charges plus Q and minus Q is to L and between plus 2Q and minus 2Q is 4L. The electrostatic potential at point P at a distance R from O is minus alpha into QL by R square into 10 raised to power 9 volt where the value of alpha is. This question is asked J means 2024. To solve this question, we have using the concept of potential due to anywhere or general point due to dipole. Suppose this is dipole plus Q minus Q at this point P where we have to calculate the potential. And this is making angle with the center that is theta from positive. Okay. So now we have using the formula that is V is equals to 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught. Here, any one of charge that is plus Q and the distance supposed to be here, consider L that is QL by R square and the making angle that is cos theta. Okay, this theta should be taken from positive to that, that point. This concept we have using. Now, in first condition, let us we have labeled CD, AB, and this point is P and the distance from the CD that is 12 and the distance from the AB that is 4. So let us first we have to taking only this part. So here 1 upon V1 is equals to 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught. Here the charge that is Q and the distance is given that is 2L. And the joining point of this point O to P that is R. So R square and cos here 60 degree. So V1 equal to 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught. 2QL R square cos 60 that is 1 by 2. So 2 to cancel out then V1 equal to 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught QL by R square. This is first equation. Now for the second condition AB. Here the charge V1 is plus 2Q and minus 2Q and from the center that is distance same but uh, here the dipole distance that is given 4L. So we have using here V2 is equals to 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught. Here charge is 2Q and length is 4L. Okay. And R square and cos theta. Here cos theta as we here given that is 60 degree. So by using linear pair, this is become 120. So here very important things we should have to be measured the angle from positive to that point. So 120 cos 120 that is minus 1 by 2. Here 2 to cancel out. So V2 is equals to minus 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught and 4 QL by R square. This is second equation. Okay. So net potential that is V equals to V1 plus V2. Now what is the V1? Here 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught. QL by R square and V2 is minus 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught 4 QL by R square. So here 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught QL by R square taking common. So here 1 minus 4. So V and this value is given in the question that is 9 into 10 raised to power 9. Okay. QL by R square. That is minus 3. So V equals to minus 27. Minus 10, uh, 27 QL. QL by R square. Okay. So this is our net potential. Here 10 raised to power 9. Okay. So here by comparing our value that is uh, minus alpha QL R square into 10 raised to power 9 in the place of alpha. We are getting 27. So, correct answer that is alpha equal to 27. I hope so. You understood this question. Thank you. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. 
definitely when you will become success full contribution goes to your hard work but if my videos my lectures my questions will help in your success i will consider myself lucky please like share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students thank you once again take care bye bye